Okay, as I was saying before the game crashed, or not the game, uh, let's go back. So it, say, it auto saves, thank god. Um, so I'm going to put this back here, and we're going to have to rechange these. No, apparently it saved them. Let's save the outputs. What did it say to flags? Yeah. No, it didn't. So start with model hidden. Bye. Alright, and then we're gonna go back to this. And actually, I gotta reopen up Halo Race Mountain. God damn it. Do 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 do. Um. Where is it? Ah, shoot. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I had to crash. Blah, 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 blah. I probably should have started recording afterwards. <laughs> okay, here we go. Alright, now we go. Now we're back. We're back, boy. So, let's go back to the control point two. Now, let's copy all these. Alright. So, you probably get it by now. Did I just screw something up? No, I didn't. Okay. Outputs, paste. Alright, so uh, as I was trying to tell you before the thing crashed, it was disable 35 on cap set owner CP2. Wait, why does it say there's target? That's weird. Push zone, capture area. Apply sparks. Alright, I gotta figure out why it's coming in like that. Why is CP2? What was this called then? I don't know why it's calling. I don't. Okay, um. So. Let's go ahead and go back to this one. Just to see what I did here. Outputs. We got that. Let's copy that. Oh. Somehow we already got that. Flags. We don't want the model in. No, we don't. Save that. Um. Let us see. Let us see. I'm trying to think of anything else before we do the final thing. Well, let's go ahead and do the final thing. So, basically, the same thing as the last one, except there's a few different outputs this time. Let's go ahead and copy these again. Or, right, let's say. Same basic thing, rename, you know, the whole deal. Base. And this one will be called CP3. And yeah, we don't need that. We do not need that. And we don't need this. So, um, so you're going to create a object particle. Uh, info particle system and you're gonna do this it's called C I N E F X underscore gold rush pitch yawn negative 90 degrees I just called it the boom that's it and you're gonna take that and you're gonna put it right underneath so it looks like something is exploding 
I'm going to look like something is exploding. And you're going to take the EMV shake, which is pretty self-explanatory. You shake saw. Shakes. Blah, 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 Altitude, 16. Frequency, 150. Depends on what you want to do. Flags, global shake in air. And do all that stuff. Control save. Um, let's think what else. Oh, I need, you're going to want to do a, put down a brush where your prop is going to be. Let's say right here. Right, right around here. This is what it looks like it's a great object. And we're gonna browse. And we're gonna go for tools, not rules. We're gonna go for tools. And we're gonna go for our trigger. I'm gonna hit apply. I'm gonna hit Control T. We're gonna do funk. Uh, now we're doing a trigger once. Trigger ones. Here we go. Fly. Okay. One second. Let me just quickly do something. File. Go back to mountain. Let me go back to mountain. This is my map. I'm working on. It's not completely done, so don't judge. As you can see, you still got the. It's fine. Not completely working. But basically, when the bomb falls in, it'll activate the trigger. The trigger will explode. Shit will happen. Do I have two trigger onces here? No, I've got a funk respawner. Hmm. Uh, <laughs> uh, outputs. That's a bit weird. Uh, so filter name, player filter class. Uh, you know that thing that player filter classing? Yeah, we're gonna do that. And we're gonna copy these, or I'm gonna copy these. And I'm gonna hit copy because I'm too lazy. Uh, three. Okay. We're gonna minimize this. So we're gonna open that one back up. And um, so outputs. I'm gonna go ahead and paste these. On trigger, or when the bomb falls in, because it otherwise will only trigger if clients fall in. Um, you only want physics to breathe. Be the players fall in, then they activate the bombs. Good luck. Uh, class info. Um, on trigger SSP cart. Or we called it cart. Blah, blah. Start shake. You know the shake and sing bobber. The play sound on trigger. Start cart boom play sound on trigger. SSB cart boom start. All that good stuff. Oh, and I also forgot. We need some special um, path things. We got these sounds here. We got a. Um, we got a cart trigger uh, sound. We're gonna need a cart dot trigger. That's the sound name. We'll need a cart dot explode, and we'll need a cart dot falling. And I'm gonna go back to my mountains. Open it back up. And we're gonna see that on the last path here, it's gonna say we're gonna need a few special ones. We're gonna need break. Um, Let's see what else. If you have a flashlight, you'd stop it, but we don't have one. Part two. Go back to your map. No. God damn it. Cancel. 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 Did I just screw everything up? Please say I didn't. Thank God. Okay. So we're gonna paste these, and we got a on pass play the sound, play the uh, break the constraint. You know to sing the constraint. We called it constraint. And so we're gonna break that, and we're gonna kill the train. So we're gonna kill track train. So we're horrible people. Um, and play the sound again. So those are all those things. Um, dang, that should be it. Sync. 
Oh, I almost forgot. That would have been bad. Um, so we're gonna open up track train again, and we're gonna do linked pat uh for the last control point. We have a control point underscore three. Linked path. I think it was what path was the last path? Last one was path forty. Okay, Let me go back here. Debsbury. Uh, we want link path. It's gonna be path underscore forty. Why is that not working? Because I didn't spell it right. That's a lie. Okay, that should be everything except I screwed that up a little. Should be over here. That is every things I think. So I'm gonna go ahead and add a skybox and then test it, just to make sure. Means I could have forgotten something. There's so many entities. There's a high chance I could have forgotten something. Huge chance. Oh, I did forget something. So when you go for your control point, um, you want to set the blue previous point required it needs to be control point one and the previous point required here control point two okay that's something I forgot I'll save uh, well let's see we're 11 minutes into this video so I'm gonna stop it and next video we can see how we test it